Hey, what's up everybody? Finally time for that unboxing for days gone. But I think I'm going to do this one a little bit different. I'm just going to show the box, the outside, then just pull everything out and uh, do a quick display of each item. So let's go ahead and get into it. At the front of the box, the Days Gone Collector's Edition. Ben Studios. Top of the box is just some more art. Check out the side right quick. And then the back. Deacon and Sarah on the back and then some details about what comes with it. Days Gone game for PS4 system plus custom steelbook. Deacon and Bike statue by Gentle Giant. Physical and digital original music. Six collectible uh, collector's pins. Physical and digital mini art book. I'm glad they did that. So on patch for decals and voucher for DLC content. Of course, one player. 46 gigabyte minimum uh, for installation and of course PS4 Pro in hand so we've looked at the, out, looked at the outside box so let's go ahead and uh, start popping everything out one by one and uh, see what we actually get with this collector's edition of Days Gone of course I'm gonna cut that thing open nice do a quick cut so we can uh, get a better look at this nice little uh, solid box of course on top it says days gone collector's edition mm, not too shabby we go ahead and uh, open this thing right, let's see what we get when we take the top off Of course, a uh, booklet that warns us, well, a piece of paper that warns us that the art book contains spoilers, so I don't think we'll be flipping through much of that, so we'll look at the art book, book like flip through it like real, real quick, because I actually want to be surprised when I play this game. So, on top, we have that one thing I really was looking forward to, of course, that, uh, Steel book for days gone. Crack this open and see what's inside on the artwork. Oh, it actually comes with the game in it already. Oh, that's the soundtrack, my bad. So, we got the soundtrack. This is the inside artwork on this looks like. It's plain on the inside, but I don't mind that. So. The actual soundtrack and it's still put that on the side and then what else do we have the actual physical copy of the game itself not too bad and then what do we have? I think this is the art book. We have the art of days gone. I think it's nice. And don't worry folks, we will be doing an individual uh, peek at everything. So it's just a quick what's in the box itself. And what this lifts up. Oh yeah, we might have to do some adjustments. Pull all of that out. 
bottom of the box. Nothing inside. popped out so you can see the statue all the way all right cut off most of the uh, plastic to get to the extra stuff that was uh, crazy the way they packed that in they secured the hell out of that but here's some decals the day's gone and also Must be the pins. Yeah. Let's tuck. Put some light on that so you can see that a little bit better. The pins. They secured the hell out of that, man. Let's go ahead and get to the real meat and potatoes of this joint. Free this statue without breaking something. Time job there, folks. Go ahead and get a close up on this. See some of this deep. All right. Did a good job on the art and the little details with the scratches and everything on the bike. Tattoos. You can barely see deep size, you gotta get at an angle to see them. That's a nice detail. This bike from a different angle. <laughs> He straight ran him over. Not too bad, not too bad. Not that heavy either. It's got a little bit of weight, but not too heavy. Not heavy to the point you'd be like, if it falls, it might break up too bad, but not too bad. Let's take some more detailed looks at the other stuff that came with this collector's edition. Let's take a closer look at what we ended up getting, of course, in this little package. Ben Studios, there he's going on. Of course. 
Hopefully we have these pins again. Oh, the little melee weapon with the uh, the axe. Try to build that in the game. Of course, we have the art of days gone. A nice little finish on that. Do a quick flip. So we don't get too many spoilers going for ourselves here. Physical copy of the game itself. And I'm going to assume that the uh, DLC vouchers are inside of this, like most uh, collector's editions. So, the physical game. And of course, that steel book. And they actually, this actually does have some. Uh, D balls in order, which I actually like. I like when they do steel books and they have D balls in it, so that's tight. Did a good job with that. In the front, in the front is also D balls too. So that's tight because I do love me a steel book that's D balls and M balls. So, I think that's about it. We can wrap it up now. All right, everybody, that's everything that comes with the Days Gone Collector's Edition. Hope you enjoyed the video and make sure if you did enjoy the video make sure to give the video a like and also comment and let me know what you think about this collector's edition of Days Gone. I think it's pretty on point. Plus I like the fact that it actually came with a mini art book. Sometimes they just do digital, but this actually comes with the physical copy and a digital version of it, as well as the physical copy of the soundtrack and a digital version of the soundtrack. So that was a nice little extra touch because sometimes when they do these um, collector's edition releases, they leave a lot of that stuff out. So I really appreciate that. So otherwise than that, the only thing I got left to do is uh, jump into this game and get lost in this world. and. Uh, See if it was actually worth the wait. But otherwise than that, I will catch you all in the next one. Thank you for watching. All right, everybody.